All right. All right. All right. Well, I thought I'd start with a win of the week that I think will really entice you. If you're into real estate, you know that there's many different ways that you can purchase property, many different ways that you can make money in real estate. Well, one of the ways that I discovered is what I call a trade, right? So what if you go sit down with a seller and maybe you've paid attention before and you know that we have a process that we do with a seller. So we make a presentation, we tell them who we are, what we do, how we operate, how we can help, how we're different than others and so on. And then we finally get to our cost to sell worksheet. And this cost to sell worksheet is how we get down to the bottom line number of purchasing a property. Well, I did one of those recently and I proposed it to the seller. They, we got to the bottom line number and they said, okay, whatever. And I said, well, let me ask you a question. What are you looking for? And they said, well, we're looking for a three bedroom, two bath. We're looking in a certain area of town. We want to be near our grandson and our son. And uh, we want to be near a hospital and so on. So they gave me all their criteria that they were looking for. I said, let me ask you a question. If I were to find that house for you and I were to buy that house and you were to move in, say from here to there, and then we take over this property, would that work for you? Oh my gosh, they got so excited. They said, yes, that would work fantastic. And you got to think about where they were coming from. I mean, think about this. You got to sell your property in order to have the money in order to buy another property. So what do you do? You might have to sell and now pack up everything, put it in storage, go rent an apartment and go hunt for the other property and then eventually buy that property. Take everything out of storage, move into that other house where I propose, look, let's just do a swap. Would that work for you? Man, so exactly what you're looking at right now in front of you, that is my swap property that we just closed on last Friday. And it is exciting that we now have an opportunity. We've already put a brand new roof on the house. We're inside the house doing some repairs, doing some fix up before they even see it. So uh, if they don't want the property, I'm not worried at all. I've got other buyers. And so we'll go ahead and sell this property to somebody else if they don't love this property. But I think they're going to love it. It's everything that they said that they wanted. So we'll, we'll keep you tuned on that. Stay tuned for another options and opportunities uh, as we move forward on the transaction. Now, another win of the week. Oh, well, there you go. There's interior shots. Uh, forgot to had that in there. And uh, so now you can see it's a nice big property, very comfortable, nice backyard, flat, got a good workable kitchen there. Got to do some work on those floors. That's what I uh, am proposing to swap with them. Now, the other win of the week I thought I'd share with you is Eric and Lily Cooper. They are street smart. They started with me over a year ago. They've now done 18 properties using my program. I'm so proud of them. And they are definitely offering people the path to home ownership, the opportunity as certified affordable housing providers to make a difference out there in the world. So sure enough, this mobile home is a great example. They bought it. It's a three bedroom, two bath, 1200 square foot. Seller was moving quickly. They asked $26,000. They negotiated and were able to do it the street smart way, which is with the seller being the bank. We love the seller being the bank. Of course, there's always an opportunity for cash deals, but even better is when the seller will carry back the financing. You don't have to raise that money. So sure enough, $3,500 down. Uh, and that included the appliances. Uh, and they're going to pay that off over four at four hundred dollars a month for sixty months at zero interest. Now think about that. Now that's on the buy side of the deal. Repairs only a thousand dollars. They sold it using our path to home ownership program. Family with kids like the school district. They got it at the gold level in our program. That means the 
agreement for deed owner financing level of the program. They sold it for $45,000. You can see a markup already, right? $5,000 down, $725 a month. Um, and that's for 240 months at nine and three quarters percent interest. Signed a contract 45 minutes after they picked up the keys on the purchase of the home. So that's exactly what we like to do. We like to already have a customer in line for the property so that when we buy it, we sell it the same day. And separately, Street Smart Profit Center that we teach you about on asset management is that we uh, separately, he separately sold them the appliances for $150 a month for 48 months. So that's another $7,200 profit center in that particular deal. The, the appliances were only six months old, so they had some real quality and value there. So the income cash flow for the first five years, because they are paying off that underlying financing, it's like taking money out of one pocket, and putting it in the other pocket, because there's absolutely no interest on that financing. But as far as cash flow goes, that brings it down to $425 a month. Now, separately, the people are paying the lot rent as well. But you can see this is just clean cash flow off that property. And it's a great example of what you can do when you learn how to do business the street smart way. Uh, there are great options and opportunities where we solve sellers problems. This seller needed to move quickly. They didn't need the money right now. They did like the idea of cash flow over the next five years. And that's exactly what they're going to be getting is that extra $400 a month coming in when their bills are due. So it's always an option and an opportunity to ask people if they would consider doing financing. I want to remind you that coming up is our Millionaire Jumpstart. That's going to be December 3rd, 4th and 5th in Atlanta, Georgia. So definitely want to get you there. Definitely want to help you to build an amazing business in real estate, go to millionairejumpstart.com, millionairejumpstart.com. All right. So back to what I was teaching you about the 10th step in managing your assets. 